Hey, who, who is that? Brandon, what are you doing, man? Are you digging through the trash? No, I was just trying to make sure there was no dangerous material in there because the garbage man would like, you know. You were digging through the trash. Yeah, it's just been kind of hard since Vine died. Is this a cake? Oh yeah, my God. Brandon, what? It's, it's in the trash. Dude, that's like. Oh, Brandon, no. Get out of hold of yourself. Let me talk to the guys. Why, why don't you just move in here? You want to move into the, the vlog house? Yeah. I'm not going to do that, okay? What? I have dignity. I have self-respect. Somewhere healthy? Healthy? Maybe we should head to Sherman Oaks. Okay. So how's your uh, VD going on? <laughs> <laughs> not my chlamydia, my VD. Your VD, yeah. <laughs> how's your VD? Should we, should we ambush Manon? <laughs> just go in there, like, documentary style? Go in the documentary style? Yeah, just Where have you been? She shot a pilot. Manon shot a pilot? She shot a pilot? Why would she do that? Why would she shoot a pilot? No, no, that's a term in showbiz. Did when the, you shoot a pilot, it's like, it's the first- Is she in Guantanamo Bay now? The first episode, they call it the pilot. How can you be calm about this right now? No. She shot, what if he was part of the Air Force? Look, she- She shot she's part of our military, down. No, she sent her headshot and she got the pilot. So, she shot a pilot, and then she shot herself in the head. That's what you're saying? No. She said, what has been going on with her? I know she was having a tough time, but I never thought that she'd pull a... She never thought she'd pull a double suicide on anybody. Brent, I'm trying to talk the entertainment business with you. The entertainment business? What do you mean, the entertainment business? What is that? Hey, did I tell you that I met the uh, CEO of CAA the other day? And uh, I'm going to be a series regular and an executive producer on this new um, live-action single-camera sitcom. Okay, well... There you go. She shot a pilot? No! In the face? Dude, a bunch of comments on my last video said you were a dick. Spot on. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> People got this weird idea that David is like a total douche and dick to his friends, and it's, it's not true. Guys, you guys are literally sounded like, I was like, okay, ready? Action. Go Scott. <laughs> I think what you did was really funny, though. It was a joke conversation. But it was like when Liza comes up to me and she's like, does Jason really like me? Or like... Liza comes up to you and asks like, me if I like her? Yeah, it's like, it's like... That's weird that you just so, walked in. That's so weird that you walked in. You're never here. Of course I like no, you. I think like, you're, a, you're the you're the best out of everybody. <laughs> <See>? <laughs> Basically, what I'm saying is there's been times where Liza's been like, does Jason like me or does he just like pretend? Like, he seems like he's not like honest when he says he likes me. Because the way you come off sometimes is like you're literally being too nice and you're being so nice to the that point where... That is shady. Are you all that insecure? Give me your Jason Nash impression. <gasps> that's a good one. Oh, that's a good one. Oh, I like that one. We should film that. Like, we should film that. I think <laughs> it is endearing, but at the same time, it's like, wait, is he serious? Like, we've shot so many sketches together. It's like one last and I genuinely, genuinely, genuinely love them. I think they're so good, and I'm so proud of them. This, this, okay. this is like weird. Okay, all right, it's weird. I'll fucking move out. I don't know what to say. Hang on, hang on, check it out. Check what out. Why well, you brought me out here to listen to this? Who is this even? Ace of Base. So this is the place I was talking about. Yeah. Stone Oven. Okay. Now I feel like you're a sandwich guy, right? I mean, dude, you can read me like a book, man. I'm all about that. <laughs> you're eating salada? Yeah. Just get salada. Okay. okay so salad you, bag. Do all your salads here. And then Brandon, look. Look at all that different meats you can get. This place looks so exotic and new and unique. There's Chipotle right down the street. We should just go there. No, <laughs> I won't eat Chipotle. I don't yeah. like it. Oh, can we go into Lids? Lids? Like a container store? No. Like just like, like, like this is, look, it's a lid. No. Yeah, you may not have to go now. No, oh, cool. Eat your salad. Cool hats, man. Friends. Let's get, let's get a cool lid like what the kids wear. It's all over for you. <laughs> no, it's not. You, you can't, you, I know you're trying to. Weird 30 year old that's still hanging around the high school. You're like Matthew McConaughey in uh, Days and Confused, <laughs> except you're 43. I'm actually not loving these lids. Have you ever met Wetzel? Oh, yeah. He's fucking dope. It's funny that Wetzel would go into pretzels. Poor Wetzel, he had no other choice. What if Wetzel was like, I want to be a fashion designer? And they were like, You do pretzels. That's what you do, son. Jason, I found the perfect girl for you, okay? She can finally get past the whole, like, you know, just. Oh, uh, we move your face? Yeah. <laughs> Her name's Sally. She's a real go-getter. It's nice to meet you. She was a numb. I got patted down at TSA the other day. Guy gave me, dude, up was, here. Wait, was, in, it, was in this here. in the airport? Was this outside yeah. the airport? In the air. Because that wasn't TSA. He just told you, I'm with TSA. Let me feel your... 
Yeah, that hadn't happened to you? I think you got sexually insulted <laughs> by me. Not, none of it works for me. I'm sorry, Banana Republic. We have to go. Yeah, a quick spin. Quick spin around a quick, a quick peruse. I didn't know they sold David's merch here. I bought that shirt right there. Would you punch me in the face as I left the store? <laughs> yeah, absolutely, yeah. Let me get you doing this in public. dancer as I've gotten older. I used to be like, okay. I want to look cool, Brandon. I'm not giving up. I need clothes and I can't pull the trigger. Definitely pull the trigger. <laughs> Jason, that's the, don't buy clothes. Just cut out the middleman and go straight for the, <laughs> straight for the trigger. I'm going to put this stuff on. I'm not giving up. Jason, this outfit you have on right now perfectly, perfectly encapsulates who you are as I'm a person. I'm trying to get out of this. Don't you get it? How about that? Black, black. No That's a Todd shirt right there. This Two, is? 225. Track jacket, track jacket. No. No? Well, you don't run track. Rag and bone. Hey, you know why they call it rag and bone? I feel like you're going to say something really perverted right now. Okay, how about this? That's no. Because so of my man tits? Yeah. Come on. No? Is that something like a skipper would wear on a boat? Looking for Han Solo. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so Brandon humiliated me into saving about $500. Uh, it was for your own good. And uh, Sometimes I see women's stuff and I'm like, hey, I'd like to wear that. <laughs> hey, that looks so comfortable. It does, though. It does actually look very Like, how sweet would that be? Love this song. Yeah, dude, listen, flash dance. This is copyright music, you know that, right? Yeah, so? You can only put this in your video for like... My dad tried to make me do the dishes the other day. So I was like, you better watch yourself or I'm gonna call ice. You know? <laughs> it was like, I was like, are you guys enjoying your tacos? Where are you guys going? Where are you going? We're going to the gym. You already went to the gym this morning. Yeah, two a days, baby. No. Yeah, and then we're going tanning. No. Free tanning right here. Shut the front door. Why? He went to the gym this morning. They went to the, I this watched morning? the two of them walk out this morning. I thought it was a different day, but it was what this morning. Can, what more can you do, really? What are you trying to do? You know, we went earlier to get swole. We're going now to lose these rolls. <laughs> are, they, are they mentally challenged? <laughs> Second time to the gym, and then you're tanning. In the same <laughs> bed, too, bro. <laughs> All right. We're gonna shower together to save water. Remember how Brandon called me mentally challenged after I made a little rhyme earlier? Yeah. Alright, well, you know why we go to the gym? Mm. Survival of the fittest. You know what it is when we get to the gym? Mm. Arrival of the fittest. <laughs> See ya. Asperger's. It's like when Liza knows you guys shot a bad bit together. I don't think we shot a bad bit. Liza? Which one didn't you like? I thought the one where you were going to the store, I thought it was really cool, I thought it was really cute. It was so funny! I wasn't sure about it though, so I went to David and he was like, yeah, it was kind of bad. And then you were like, yes! Yes! People <laughs> so, this was so good! People fucking loved it! Like, if you talk to your kids like this, which you do, it's perfect. But I feel like we're older, so we're like, okay, stop being our dad and like, tell us the truth. I, I, I think you're right. I think you're all still kind of snotty teenagers. Like, you still have that kind of thing, like a rebellious thing, like, especially you guys are so young. Like, you still have that kind of thing, like a rebellious thing, like, not everything's cool. I gotta create problems for myself, even no, though everything's I... great. Whereas I've done so much where I'm like, I'm so glad to be alive. Yeah, I don't. The comments are gonna say, Jason, you just keep being yourself. <laughs> you keep being happy. And you're gonna get that. And I want you to keep being happy too. What really upsets me is if you think I'm being disingenuous. That really, really fucking upsets me. No. And I can't think of anything that would upset me more that that anyone would think that I'm getting kind of scared right now. That I no, <laughs> I mean, but I mean that's the yin and the yang of life. Like there's people that are down <laughs> if you're really sad, and then there's David. People that are dicks. <laughs> <laughs> All right, there's something truly magnificent about being sad, and that is that everyone can be sad. Some people are sad sometimes, other people are sad all the time, and this is just a song about being sad. whoop de doo let's get to it! <laughs> I've got a problem, I'm always so sad. The littlest things get me pissed off or mad. My life's pretty good, no one- well, Thanks for coming, that was really fun. We had a good day together. Went to the mall, bought some clothes, and I just wanna let you know. We had enough of the camera. All right, everybody, please hit like, subscribe, tweet me at Jason Nash, Instagram at Jason Nash. Today's shout out is right here. I don't know who it is, but that was Brandon. He's a cool guy. He was just doing a bit. He'll be back.
Hey. Yeah. I, I fucking hate your guts. <laughs>